that down. Good morning. I'm Dwight Schmuck, and this is today's Schmuck Look. Today I'm talking to and about Jamie Lynn Spears. She's 16 years old, star of a highly successful TV show, and she's dumb enough to get knocked up. 16, not the brightest age we all know. But my God, you are the star of a kids show, highly rated, you know, very successful. And you met the guy in church. That's that's the the funny part as far as I'm concerned. Uh, yeah, he's a pipe layer. Well, he laid his pipe. <laughs> and you took it seriously. That's what pregnancy is, folks. What a woman takes serious, what a guy pokes at her in good, clean fun. Casey, you're not so bright. You can't figure out how to buy and use a condom? Well, you're not a pipe fitter, are you? They make more money. We know who's going to be supporting this kid. Oh, my God, this poor little thing. She's 12 weeks or so pregnant, and this kid already has more strikes against it than Michael Jackson. I mean, come on, Jamie. Your mom's not a real wiener here. Yeah, uh, Brittany's, you know, not a great role model. Her kids are back and forth like we're playing dominoes or bingo or something. She's in and out of rehab. Told not to drive. Says, hey, I'm rich and cute. I can do it anyway. And you're coming down the same path. This is a tragedy. It really is. All the way around. It really, really is. <laughs> Second... This is funny. The Caribbean nations of Antigua and Barbatum have won a $21 million judgment against the United States because the U.S. shut down the electronic gambling from those two countries back in 2006. And they went to court, the World Trade Organization, and the World Trade Organization said, yeah, you know, that is a restraint of trade, and you signed the treaties, which are contracts, and now you got to pay up, and the, the, there's no appeal to this by either side. They they got their, their what these two countries wanted was like a hundred or so times more than what they got. What they got is substantial, because, folks, that's you and me, taxpayers, paying that, because our government, well, George and the boys, being in the pockets of the bankers and everybody, saw that money going out of town without them getting a cut. And, oh, that's just not right. <laughs> I'm Dwight Schmuck. That's today's Schmuck Look. Peace, folks. Have a great weekend.